Welcome to episode 59 of Apartment Hacker. This is Mike Brewer, and tonight I'm coming to you from my backyard here in Weldon Spring, Missouri. And I was sitting back reflecting on my day today, and a story popped into my head. I have no idea where it came from, because it really wasn't associated with my day so much. But uh, when I played basketball in high school, uh, I had a coach named Steve Henry, and he was one of those fiery type coaches. Um, he was incredibly, incredibly inspiring, uh, many times <laughs> in a context of fear. Um, but I think in, in hindsight, it was really out of a context of loving and caring uh, and desiring the best for the, the boys who play basketball for him. But uh, he used to tell us before every game that his job was to lead the game, to manage the game, and our job was to pay attention uh, to the game itself. And many times during a game, he would catch us staring at the scoreboard and he would yell across the, the gym floor that, uh, that we needed to not pay attention to the score. We'd just pay attention to our play and the score would take care of itself. Um, and it, it got me thinking about our job as leaders uh, in the multifamily world, in the apartment management and property management world. And, and it really is a leader's job to manage and lead the game of making money in the real estate business um, and it really is the job of those folks that work with and for and around us to take care of the game and that is to suggest that you take care of things you know like in basketball you you dribble with intent with property management you price with intent you make crisp passes in property management you deliver crispy customer service um, meaning that you you give customer service that is remarkable and memorable and something that the resident really feels uh, valued from uh, in basketball when you have a chance to shoot a free throw you take your time and you you go through your routine and your discipline as it relates to shooting a free throw in property management you take your time to do a service request the right way uh, you take your time doing a unit turn so that there are no callbacks once a, a resident moves in. So my message for you tonight is that you teach people to take care of the game. You lead it, you manage it, you manage it rather. You teach people to take care of it uh, and not pay attention so much to the scoreboard. Uh, but if you do those things correctly, that scoreboard in, in, uh, in the multifamily space, that financial statement, that return to the investor, but will take care of itself. So uh, that's it for tonight. I hope that you have a tremendous day tomorrow, and we will talk to you soon.